Hello. I just wanted to pop to see you to say just a little bit of a thank you for all of the lovely messages that you've sent me with regard to the videos that I've put into the group, giving advice on how to set yourself up as a tutor. I thought one of the best ways to deal with what's happened as a result is to show you again one of the questions that you keep asking me. How do you actually tutor online? Because that seems to be a bit of a block at the moment for people who are thinking of becoming a tutor. They know that online's the route, but they're a bit worried about the practicalities and the technicalities of how to do it. So it's really simple. I'd never been online before March. I hadn't even considered it. I was the face-to-face -face tutor. And the first thing I said to myself was, there's no way I was going to go online unless I could guarantee the same level of quality. And the only way I could guarantee the same level of quality is if I could assimilate the environment with which I tutored. Now I'm the type of tutor who's old style chalk and talk. I like a whiteboard, I like a pen, I like children taking notes. So I knew I had to kind of replicate what had gone on within my environment. So I didn't want also a load of software around me. I wanted to keep it really simple because I didn't want anything to go wrong technically. So this is what I did. The first thing I did was I invested in a decent microphone. I think I got that for 19 pound off eBay. It came the following day, it plugs into my laptop. And one of the things I know is I can guarantee that I've always got good sound. The next thing I did was I invested in a gooseneck. And I'm going to tell you why I have a gooseneck. It's, it's screwed onto my desk here. Because what I needed to be able to do was have a whiteboard. I always tutor using Zoom. So I am the host of Zoom on my laptop. So what I'm on now, I am hosting this meeting. However, on my phone, I have the Zoom app. So the Zoom app on my phone will receive a link. Now in a minute, I am going to join this tuition group as my phone, which I have named on this Zoom account, on this app as Sharon's whiteboard. So I can see in the waiting room, Sharon's whiteboard is waiting to come in. So I'm going to admit Sharon's whiteboard before the session even begins. I connect. I am going to make sure I have muted the audio. So the volume's down. I am going to, see, I need to get the volume down so there's no feedback. I mute the volume there, I mute the volume there. And now what I do is I start the video. So you will see, I have another camera available to me. That camera, which is my phone, is on the gooseneck. And for a fiver from Tesco, I've got a whiteboard that I slide underneath. And now what I can do quite nicely, kids, today's date, we are on the 2nd of July, 2020. Let's get tutoring. Those children can see my face and I have got the ability to be making notes that they can copy down. I have also got the option then if I want to put a worksheet underneath, I'm not sharing screens and I'm also not relying on anything too much in terms of technology. So I bought a gooseneck from Amazon, I bought a decent mic, I bought a whiteboard from Tesco and I invite my phone via an app as if it is a pupil on the call. Tip, you'll get feedback, so make sure your volume's down, you're on mute and you've silenced the audio as well there. And that's simply how I do my tuition online and it works for me. Hope that was helpful. Thank you.